Today's video is about making developer out of red wine. So I'm going to use a similar recipe to the mint tea developer video. Instead of using the mint tea, I'll be using red wine. I'm interested in using this red wine, first of all because it's Christmas and um, we usually drink mulled wine at this time of year, so it might be quite handy for anybody who's left with mulled wine and doesn't know what to do with it say if it's gone bad or something like that. I have leftover red wine this month because the corkscrew broke and ended up mashing the cork into the wine so I didn't really feel like drinking it after that. Um, so instead I'm going to turn it into a developer and we'll get on to making that now. So the first thing that I'm going to do is measure out 40 grams of soda crystals. Now I'm going to pour out 150ml of hot water, which I've just boiled. It's dripping everywhere. And the soda crystals will go into the water and we'll mix that until they are fully dissolved. So now I'm waiting for that to dissolve, I'm going to measure out 10 grams of vitamin C. Now my soda crystals have dissolved, I'm going to pour in the vitamin C until that has dissolved also. You can see how it's fizzing. I'm now going to measure out 150ml of red wine and add that to the mix. over but it will just be more potent. Is that the cork as well? <laughs> Yummy. It smells delicious like a fruity cocktail. Now that I've mixed these together I'm gonna add water up to 600 millilitres so you can see what I'm doing here. That's exactly 600 millilitres. So I'm going to stir that and then I'm going to leave it overnight until the next day. So it's the next day now and my developer has been steeping for about 24 hours. Something just happened when my partner walked into the dark room and said, why is it so dark in here? Just as I was changing the film. Um, so there's a possibility that my film is fogged but I'm going to try anyway and see what happens. I've had light get to my film before and thought oh no it's not going to work and it's actually come out fine. So I'm just going to go ahead and see what comes out. If it's fucked I'll just try again using the same developer. It's absolutely fine and um, just possibly a little bit of film wasted. So I'm going to go ahead and pour the developer into the canister now. So I'm going to get my film and I'm going to pour in the developer which I've stored in this fetching Morrison's coffee cup. Ooh, smells Christmassy. Okay, so I'm gonna leave that now for 30 minutes and then I'm going to fix as usual. It smells so, so strong. Okay, I've now developed the film. I've washed it and fixed it. Um, so I'm going to pour out the water and see if the developer works. It looks purple. So, yes it worked. And I don't know if you can see here but the film is pink. So you should be able to see that the film has come out. You can see an image. These are photographs that I took on a walk yesterday along the cliffside in Ramsgate. Um, and you can see on the right hand side that the film has been fogged, it's a kind of darker side where the sprocket holes are. Um, that's when Sam walked in on me developing the film. But it just goes to show it's still worth giving it a go even if you think that you might have ruined the film. Because it's come out fine and it'll 
be interesting to see what these look like when they're scanned. <laughs>